Hello YouTube, Eric DIY here with another great review for you. Today we're reviewing the Bike Flip by Bike Evolution. A set of jacks for your handlebars for your bike that will help you repair it on the go. The first look, you're probably like, why do I need a pair of these? Well, if you ever get stuck on the road and you have to repair your bike, anything that helps you is worthwhile. These are the Bike Flips by Bike Evolution. Really built sturdy and we're gonna go try them out. I'm gonna try mounting my e-bike with these jacks so that go on your handlebars. Why would you want to flip your bike over? Well, sometimes it's a lot easier to fix things that way. It'll act like its own stand while you're fixing a chain or something like that. I'm gonna test out the uh, bike flips here. Let's pretend that I had a flat tire in the front or back. The reason why I wanna use the bike flips is because if I flip the bike upside down, get direct access to the wheel and I don't have to worry about lifting the bike off the ground or anything like that to get the wheel off. It's counterproductive to do that so the bike flips would help out. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to remove the back bag. Big pro about the bike flips is that they hold together. You're going to pull them apart so it's easy to store in your bag. Very very small. It's like the inner part of my hand. So that's how small they are. We are going to have to modify it for the flared wrist handles here. We're just going to stick them on there. If you have a regular size one, it's actually going to hold pretty tight with the flared wrist. If you had a regular one, we're going to show you what that looks like later on. We're going to pretend that I have a flat tire out here with my e-bike. I was able just to rotate this down. I'm just going to adjust it so that's pointing straight up. You're going to land on the thicker part of the bike flip on the concrete. So I'm going to carefully turn this over. This is the heaviest part. So I'm going to try to flip it over. But again, this is going to take some of the pressure off if I have to replace that front tire. I'm going to roll it up. And flip it over just really carefully. Now we're on the seat and the bike flips. And there you go, it's holding between the seat and the bike flips. Everything's off the ground, including the light, which is very close to the ground. So now I could go about repairing my tire here. It is very sturdy. I'm pushing down on this right now. It's not budging. Left and right, again, it's not held entirely like the way it's designed because of the flared out handles, but it is working and it would definitely get me through repairing this. The other thing that would help too is if I had a problem with my electronics on the e-bike, I could get in here easier. Everything would be supported right here on my seat and the bike flips. If I wanted to oil the chain, that's another thing I could do right there. Take the oil and oil it through. Overall, the bike flips are really good the way that they're holding. So even with flared handles for wrist support, the bike flips work. You can put them on there enough. They're maneuverable enough so that you can hold up the bike there, as you can see. That is a heavier e-bike than what a regular bike is. That's how you use these bike flips. Again, oil the chain. You can work on the electronics of the e-bike if you have a problem. If you had a deflating tire, you could work on this side or that side, and that's what the bike flips are for. Very easy to handle in your bag as well. Very small and compact. As far as putting them on and everything, it took me like three minutes at most, and that's pulling my bag off as well. Maybe three to five minutes with the bag. Really easy to do. And then we're just gonna roll up the bike ever so carefully going forward to get them back up. The hardest thing is just the fender in the back here. You have to be very careful. Whoops up. Gonna go really careful. You're gonna roll it really careful. And there you go. Flip's gonna come off. And then you're just gonna store them by clipping them in. There's this little thing there that goes into this hole. And then boom, compact, easy to go. Non marking, really, really strong. Overall, it's good to have this pair of Bike Evolution bike flips. Uh, we're gonna try them on a more standard handlebar bike, but they definitely even work with the flared ones, as I showed you. You just gotta be a little bit more conscientious about where you're putting it and putting them on there, but it will fit. You just have to rotate them in here and there and then adjust them at the end. As for how compact and small they are, this is the smallest pocket in the whole thing. I leave it there for like tools I can grab really quickly. And this is where this will go. You can notice that it's already chock full of stuff. It's got a wrench in there, some gloves to fix things with. And you can fit it right in there and zipper it like so. So it doesn't weigh a lot and it's uh, awesome, especially for people like me who take their e-bike for commuting. Being out there and knowing that I can repair my bike a little easier is always worth it. I wanna show you the bike flips on different types of bicycle. He has the straighter handlebars. We have to remove the water bottle, I think I'm gonna leave the bag and the lights because this should elevate it enough. To put the bike flips on again, you're gonna unclip them. On this one, see how they open up? That's because that will keep the bike flip securely on there. Now, we're gonna do the same thing on the other handlebar. We're gonna keep it open like a tent in the shape of a V. I'm gonna keep this side down towards the ground right here. And that will support the bike on the seat. We just have to kind of watch it on there. Kind of flip it around. Notice that there's no fender, so it's a little easier. I'm gonna go on the bike seat, make sure the bike flips are pointed down. 
and that they're open and flared up. Again, if he has a flat tire or something, we just have to worry about these two nuts. This is not going anywhere. They're, they're supported fully with the seat and the bike flips. And just a close up, see how they're flared out? That's what gives it leverage on the handlebars and on this side as well. That's not going anywhere. And that's how you can repair the bike on the go. Bike flips are definitely a handy thing to have. Looks my wife's bike. And again, it's kind of like a beach cruiser style bike. Her handlebars are more angled out, obviously being a uh, beach cruising type bike, but we can still use the bike flips on them. Then just spread them off for leverage. So I'm gonna try flipping the bike over on its side. And I'll lift it up. I'm gonna put it on the seat. Very carefully. It's doable. You do have to be careful on the rack there, but if you have something to pad it there, you're gonna be fine. But I just wanted to show you that in many different types of bicycles, it is possible to use the bike flip and work on your bike. Pros and cons about the bike evolution, bike flip. Pros, compact, easy to use, non-marking. It held up to all three of those bikes. Works on e-bikes, works on different handles. You might have to modify it for uh, some, but you can definitely get it on there and actually have it support it. I like that it clips together for easy storage. It offers as much support as you want by flaring these out into a V. Overall, it's good to have. You know, if you have to change a tire or something, tube on the road you can have something that will help you out it's definitely easier flipping the bike upside down on the seat and the bike flip cons about the bike evolution bike flip it's a little harder on smaller handles but you can use it on kids bikes on my wife's beach cruiser it would have been nice to have been able to bounce on the seat but it's just the way the bike's designed so it will work on all the bikes i've shown you you just want to be careful if i had this on the road i feel a lot better about changing a tire out easily portable in the bag like i I said it's going to stay there ready to go for any type of thing i could also use this during general maintenance of uh, oiling the chain working on the electronics if i had to on the e-bike or anything like that so it is a good product to get and i do recommend having one in your bag for repairs if you would like to buy the bike evolution bike flip please look for a link in the description below we'll send you to the bike evolution website in the link below it will help support the Eric DIY channel. And if you like this video and you want to see more like it, please give us a thumbs up and push that subscribe button below. While you're down there, also push on the bell notification icon so that way you'll be notified of future Eric DIY video releases. We appreciate all your support. Bike on. I'll see you later. As always, if you like this video, found it useful, please subscribe. And if you have a product that you would like reviewed, please contact Eric by emailing him at Eric. 5150 DIY at gmail.com. Have a great day.